Building apps just changed again, and this time it's not about faster prompts, it's about control. What I'm about to show you is one of the most powerful AI app building workflows that I've personally used. Because it doesn't just generate code, it executes on intent. Rocket.noob, which is today's video sponsor, lets you command AI to build real production grade applications end to end without scaffolding, retries, or prompt gymnastics. We've covered Rocket.new a few months ago, and since then, it has gotten drastically better with a new precision mode that uses command-based AI for more accurate, predictable builds. And now, the Rocket.new mobile has launched. This is where full build environments aren't just locked to your desk anymore. You can create, iterate, and ship real apps directly from your phone during commutes, coffee breaks, or whenever an idea hits. This isn't just a demo trick or a lightweight companion app. It is something that will get your vision to production from anywhere. So if you're looking to get started with the Rocket.no mobile app, you can definitely do so by heading over to the iOS store and you can install it quite rapidly through your phone. Or you can just search Rocket Pocket App Studio on the app store and download it from there. And this is where you can have it so that it gives you a full build environment off of your iOS. I'll leave a link to this in the description below so that you can easily get started with it. But what's wild is that with Rocket.new Mobile, you can put your full build environment within your pocket. I can simply just unlock my phone, open up a project, and make updates anywhere, whether if I'm in the train or if I'm at a coffee shop or even mid-meeting. If I see a bug or get a client request, I can fix it instantly. I can deploy features from my phone, tweak the UI, approve anything that I need all from my phone. And this is truly a game changer. But going back to Rocket.no's new precision mode update, this is pretty groundbreaking because it introduces a command-based AI that gives you predictable first try results without prompt engineering or retries. This is essentially going to let you build apps way clearer and better because you can just structure using the slash command to make the exact content UI and integration change. And you can even use the at command to target the update to a specific file or folder only. That means no unexpected side effects, no cascading changes, just precision controlled app building. But just take a look at the quality of output. This is where it generated a knowledge hub, which is an app that lets you discover, learn, and collaborate on various sorts of topics. And you can see the quality of output where it has various sorts of features like a mind map, you have the ability to use various sorts of AI features like an AI assistant, different sorts of visualization like charts, generating reports, and so much more. This is where Rocket.no is capable of generating all of the components for you end to end with strict guidance using slash commands. And with different sorts of integrations like an open AI integration, you can connect AI models to analyze documents, enable natural language queries and summaries, and so much more. So I'll leave a link to this in the description below so that you can easily get started and you can get started with a free tier. So that is perfect. You also have the ability to export to Figma, import Figma designs, add in different sorts of files, and you can work with various sorts of frameworks as well and integrations like GitHub, different sorts of databases and payment gateways. So simply go ahead and create an account if you do not have one. And if you do, you can simply go ahead and sign in and we can get started. Before we get started, I just want to mention that you should definitely go ahead and subscribe to the World of AI newsletter. I'm constantly posting different newsletters on a weekly basis. So this is where you can easily get up to date knowledge about what is happening in the AI space. So definitely go ahead and subscribe as this is completely for free. So now that we have set up our account, what we can then do is within the main dashboard. This is where you want to be as descriptive as possible when you're trying to direct Rocket.new to build any sort of production ready app. You want to be descriptive as possible in terms of laying out all of the features that you want to add to your app so that when Rocket.new deploys multiple agents, it is going to be able to thoroughly take in the context that you provide it to build it out end to end. So this is where I'm requesting it to build out a finance manager web app that has a user authentication, a secure data storage, where it's going to integrate an integration like one of these to have a backend setup for my database. It is also going to integrate something like OpenAI to provide AI-driven features like 
categorizing reports, or just using AI to enhance the user experience within my app. There's going to be a lot of other capabilities like visualization, adding a Stripe ready subscription support. By simply just requesting it to add these features, it'll use integrations that are best needed to develop your app. So once we had provided our description of what we wanted to build, we can then send it in. You can also uh, have this either as a public app that you can create or something that is private where you can deploy this in private uh, environments only. You can also upload files like I mentioned or import Figma designs. But now let's go ahead and send this in and have Rocket.new tackle this task for us. From here, Rocket.new is going to assess what we're going to build. From here, Rocket.new will help us select the default framework that works best for this. You can see that the default framework right now is React, JavaScript, Tailwind, CSS, but you can either use this default framework or you can customize the framework where you can choose whatever you want for this app. After selecting all of the presets, like selecting the screens that you wanted to build, it is then going to take approximately 10 to 12 minutes to fully build out your application end to end. That's the beauty of Rocket.new because it is going to work with you initially to get all the steps fully configured and best suited for your own preference. And then it's going to deploy AI agents to execute those tasks for you. And once finished, you're going to have a full functional app with all the integrations that you want it to, to actually have, as well as all the features that you, you requested in natural language. What's great is that as it is actually generating your app, you can get a live preview of the code being generated. And it is also going to showcase logs based off the terminal based commands it uses. And what you can also do is you can export this code by either downloading it or by publishing it straight to GitHub, which is an incredible feature. But there we go. Just take a look at this finance app, which looks actually quite remarkable. And you can see that it is really appealing to your eye. And this is where we have created the main dashboard of our app, which showcases the spending overview as well as the analytics, like quick actions, like adding a transaction. Now, obviously within the editor mode, you can see that it highlights all of the components and that is a feature part of Rocket.new. So if I was to highlight this, it will directly attach it to the chat panel where I can request the AI agent to fix or improve a certain component. But essentially you have recent transactions, a budget alert, and there's also AI powered insights. And this is thanks to the integration that we had added from OpenAI. If you click on integrations, this is where you can manage all of them, like setting up a database. You can easily connect to Superbase and you can connect it to your app. You can add in a payment provider, which we did. You can also have it connected to something like Google AdSense. You, this is a simple way for you to use various sorts of integrations directly within your app. And this is the AI chat assistant that we had added. And it's something that actually responds back with live data based off of the analytics that is there within our app. So in this case, I asked it how much did I spend on dining last month? And it provides me my spending data where I spent $847 on dining last month, which is definitely quite steep. But you can see that this AI assistant powered by the OpenAI integration works within this app thanks to Rocket.no deploying these agents and integrations. Now looking into the new feature, you have the ability to use the act command so that if there is a specific component that you want to tweak, you can tell the AI that I want to tweak this specific area and you can provide context to Rocket.no so that it can tackle a full on folder or a certain file where it can improve it. You can also use the slash commands. This is the new feature that rocket.new has provided where these are a hundred plus different commands that are configured already to add a preset to your app. So if you want to add a certain animation or effect that rocket.new has added for different pages, you can simply click on this and it will add a page transition. In the same manner, if I want to add something like brand identity, like adding a light or a dark theme, you can simply click on this and it will add it to your app. There's a lot of different sorts of slash commands that you can use and integrate with these presets. Think of it as a template. So I'm going to go ahead and add a light and dark theme to our app with this preset. I'm also going to set up a Stripe payments by simply adding this integration into our app. 
And in the same manner, I'm going to set up another integration like adding Superbase into our app so that we can have a full on login screen, a sign up screen, as well as a profile screen. Now I have combined all the features that we had requested with the different presets. And this is our new redefined finance app that was developed by rocket.new. And thanks to the new top of base integration, we have it create a full on authentication for us. It has also added in a dark theme, which is awesome. And we can now continue by creating an account. After creating an account, you're going to be then sent over to our app. And this is a better redefined app that has a lot more features than what we saw previously. You can add in different transactions. You have the ability to chat with an AI with the side panel now. And this is where you can ask it questions like, what is my biggest expense? And then it is going to respond with your girlfriend. I'm joking. This is where it's going to then respond with an answer stating that your biggest expense is your uh, housing, which is your largest expense. Then you can go ahead and close this. You can see that the dark mode actually works here as well. You can then head over to analytics and this is where it's gonna give you a better preview of your income versus expenses, as well as a pie chart, which showcases the spending by category. You have your wallet and then settings, which will be added later on, but this is, the quality that you can expect from rocket.new with all of these integrations built within. If you like this video and would love to support the channel, you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis, plus daily AI news and exclusive content, plus a lot more. This is what changes everything. Building apps are no longer tied to a desk, a laptop, or a perfect condition with Rocket.new, especially with the new mobile feature. This is something that is going to definitely help you in so many ways. So I highly recommend that you take a look at it with the links in the description below by visiting Rocket.new or you can download Rocket.new mobile from the app store using the link in the description below or by searching Rocket Pocket App Studio. But that's basically it, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video and got some sort of value out of it. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the second channel if you haven't already. Join the newsletter, join our Discord, follow me on Twitter, and lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, like this video, and please take a look at our previous videos because there is a lot of content that you will truly benefit from. But with that thought, guys, have an amazing day, spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.